I love celebrating. Um, I love celebrating life in general and celebrating the people in my life, my loved ones. I love throwing parties for my daughter. So I've always dreamed of doing a show where we get to celebrate people who are so deserving. And together, Hallmark and I developed uh, celebrations with Lacey Schwer and alongside um, our incredible event planners, Lisa and Marissa, we find our heroes, we learn about them, and then we spend three days planning the ultimate surprise party. And my favorite moment of every episode was seeing the look on our hero's face when they walked in and they realized that they think they're there for a hero documentary interview. And they realized that this is a huge surprise party for them. And, you know, they're surrounded by their loved ones and friends and colleagues. And it brought a tear to my eye every time. Well, it's unscripted. And so while there is a plan, things don't always go according to that plan. And people have jobs and are in school and we're trying to keep it a surprise. So we're sneaking around. And the biggest thing I learned was that we all just had to be really flexible. We lost venues because of weather issues or, you know, things happen right before the celebration. And Lisa and Marissa are incredible planners. And, you know, we had a wonderful crew putting this show together and you just go with the flow and make the best of it. And everything worked out just as it was meant to be. I cried every episode. Again, pretty much the moment when our wonderful hero walks in and they look around and take in all of the love that's in that room and realize that it's for them. That really touched my heart every time. And then getting to speak with individuals whose lives had been greatly impacted by our heroes was also very touching because you realize that, you know, so many people want to change the world and feel like, where do I start? And it's so inspiring to realize you just have to start with one person. Definitely. And that kindness has that ripple effect.